Hello, welcome back to Tail Concerto. Uh, when we left off last time, we were about to do the, um, what's it called? The factory? I don't think that's what they call it exactly, but yeah, the factory. Uh, yeah, Bannon Factory. This isn't a particularly long place, but it would have put me well over time last time. Uh, I'm also playing this time with a, uh, a noise filter on my mic. This is, uh, it's quite warm in my room here that I'm recording in, and I have to have a fan on me. I don't think it would filter out my big fan, but it, it, I did some tests and it is working pretty well on my smaller one, which does plenty of work, keeping me cool. It's just, uh, you guys don't need to hear it. All right. So let's get in on, let's get in on, on, let's, words are hard, let's get on in here. <laughs> okay. And this isn't voice for some reason. This must be the abandoned factory. What a creepy place. Something up there looks suspicious. I'll climb up the pipe and see. Okay. Yes, and this is the place. I can't open it, the door is locked. I have no choice, I'll have to look somewhere else. Like a, a similar question for this game that there is two Mega Man games. Why don't you just, like, of course Mega Man, you teleport. In this game, you have an airship. Why don't you just go to the top or wherever you see a thing? But whatever. So, yeah, these pipes, whenever you're facing them, they light up. That's honestly not that great of an indicator. <laughs> uh, because of the analog movement. I mean, it's nice to know that you're kind of looking at it, especially whenever you're hanging off of them and you jump off. You will go, like here, you, I will go mostly towards that, but since this is a 3D space, and I have an analog controller, that you can just get thrown completely off, but it does help in these situations, like here, right here, a lot more than the standing jump. And I honestly don't know which direction to push 90% of the time to go the, the way I want. Okay, completely miss it. Yeah, he, yeah. Seriously, he could have just parked the airship over here, but okay. I don't know of any easy way to deal with the tanks. I can swing at them, just do this, but I also have to get right on top of them. It is possible. I have done it, but yeah. Ouch. So this is also one of the main reasons I wanted to play on easy, because I've been mostly firing up, firing like kind of away from the camera, and you wouldn't really be able to see anything other than me just running in circles. So now you can actually see. I can actually tank the damage. Times. And not have to, uh. The door is unlocked now. And not have to do that strategy to avoid dying. So you can actually see what's going on. I will take this bone. Pretty sure there's no photo pieces in here. I don't think there are in any of the levels that cannot be repeated. Spoiler, you cannot come back here. Ow. 
I can make that jump. I just... I didn't wait for it to light up, I suppose. See, in there, I, it was... If I don't... If I uh, let go of the analog stick or D-pad or whatever you're using to control it, and just press jump, you will go right for it. That kind of goes against your instinct in these games, but... Yeah, that, that will actually make it lighting up more useful. You do take damage if you just follow that conveyor in. I don't need that. I mean, I might as well take it since I'm not going to be coming back. No, I don't. I, I seriously don't need it. This is on easy. I don't remember if the steam pipes themselves do damage or if they just let the fall do the damage. Huh. I can honestly say I've never been crushed by that before. Okay. I had intended to just keep going. And failed that. I think there's... Oh, I can grab that. I don't think there's anything in here. Well, let's try it, I suppose. We'll go around to the edge. We'll climb up to the top, like that. Okay, there's a whistle. Yeah. Okay, screw you, whistle. Yeah. I pressed the button yeah, to yeah, yeah. climb up, but he decided to fall instead. Yeah. 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 Well, there's a whistle yeah. in case you in case you're looking for them. I think I had like 15 or something like that last time I checked. Yeah. 17. Yeah, I, I'm okay on whistles, especially playing on easy. If you start with more on easy as well. Yeah. Door is unlocked now. This whistle here looks a lot easier to get. Uh. Okay then. That's called a dive. I can never do that consistently. There is even a setting in the options. Actually, to show that real quick. The diving sensitivity. I've set that to high, and I still can't do it properly. You look, you, um, like you're running one direction, and you turn another direction at the same time you press jump, and he'll do a dive. I can never, ever get it to do that consistently. Only randomly, like you just saw. That actually. Just that little time left. Alright. I don't need that. Think there's anything up here? No. If I hadn't done the little flutter at the end there, I would have taken fall, taken fall damage. I think I was actually hitting something. And you can't grab the conveyors. Ouch! Okay. Ok, 
Okay, uh, I don't think this has come up yet. Okay, then. The blue tanks do not have a kitten in them. I am, I am just not doing this room very well. I'm trying to play it too safe. So, yeah, as I was saying, the blue tanks do not have kittens in them. Yeah, I'm just... I'm just... Yep. Let's call this room, room a room. Oh. Seriously, what what was that? Just call this room a wash. The blue tanks do not have kittens, so you do not. Okay, that was entirely the game's fault. I I should have grabbed that ledge. You do not have to destroy the tanks for any reason. The blue tanks. Other than now, I'm annoyed. Whistle here, I think. It, yeah, that was whistle. Okay, I, I just did this room extremely poorly. There's also a blue tank directly above me. Oh, seriously, game, come on. What was that? Seriously, what was okay? Like to start this whole thing over. What was that? What's the okay, game. What is going on today? None of that crap. Seriously, this place is not that hard. I do not choose when he dives. The game chooses when he dives. Oh, I thought you couldn't grab the conveyors. What was all the other times I've tried to grab conveyors and you just didn't? Okay. I will be taking this. Let's see. If I can get the angle just right. Probably can't because. It's... Nope, I can't. Oh, I mean, I'm hitting it. Okay. Yeah, just play that safe. <laughs> you can hear the tank getting destroyed there. Yeah, I, I'm just not playing this place very well. It's been a, a few days since the last time I played this. Oh, okay, just grab the bomb out of midair. It's been a few days since I played this, so... I guess I need to reactivate the controls or something. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Like one of those before should have gotten that one. Right. And then lock this door. Okay, I'm just playing the factory super poorly. And also not voiced. I've seen that robot before. Of course, this factory rebuilds the robots that destroyed. This is not good. I've got to destroy them before they're completed. Oh no! They spotted me. Well, forget the kittens. I gotta destroy the robot. I don't think the robot does anything in this fight. Yeah, there's that wrecking ball and their planes. Yeah, the robot does nothing in this fight. The Wrecking Ball can do plenty of damage there. Which I prefer not to show off. You can also destroy their planes. There is no point in doing that. I think you can capture the kittens. But there's nothing 
extra for getting every kit in the game. This would be the only place to get those, or the only time to get those. Also, there's one on the wrecking ball. I don't know if I can get that one. The Black Cats Gang? No, but close. Anyway, you made quite an entrance. I was wrong to have underestimated you. Now I have to keep my eye on you. You're going to pay for what you've done. <laughs> Where are you? Come out and show yourself! <laughs> Think you can catch me? Come back here! I don't know how Waffle go back to his airship so fast. And back to not being voice. Is this their hideout? Hmm, something strange here. Maybe I should report to headquarters. Yes. Save. No. Hmm, this place is too quiet. What? yourself if you want to see me so badly I'll be waiting for you in my study on the top floor that is if you can make it <laughs> Okay, now we're trapped in here. I think if I wanted to, I could leave. Oh, right. But, I mean, where would I go? I think so far I've only missed that one whistle. If I don't actually get the whistles, I will point them out. At least ones I'm, from, I'm aware of. Although I have gotten all of them before, I'm pretty sure. Okay, just completely missed that. I need to mess with the camera more. That'll help. Scratch that, I just need to get better at platforming. When he decides to grab things, is, I don't know. I'm just gonna skip that one. Some of the rooms in here, uh, I really uh, not a fan of. Oh, I did not. I did not think it would actually knock me off. I 
I wanted... I suppose I don't need that whistle. But I guess I get, finally got up here. And a bone. that it matters, because I have to wait for that. I guess it kind of saved a little time. And there's more health right there. This place is actually fairly rough. This room in particular can be very rough. It'll be a lot better on easy, though. jump to. Yes. Because I needed that whistle. actually went pretty well. If you fall and touch the glowing floor, it kind of launches you in the air. I guess sort of like the lava in um, Mario 64. Now we are time to get through here. Uh, there is actually just plenty of time, even if I fail a bunch of jumps like this one. This room in particular I have quite a few problems with, not simply getting through, just the way it's designed. I'm not going to go for that whistle up there. Really? Yeah, so just the way it's designed, uh, you can just completely miss time all the moving platforms. Especially towards the top, and that really hurts you then. Yeah, you'd I'd jump from this platform, that mesh there, the catwalk, whatever. And that's how you get the, that whistle. I'm not going to bother with it, just show it off. Again, I don't know what direction to rotate. I'm going to be knocked off. Fantastic. This, this is going well. I'm just really playing poorly today. I 
pressed the opposite direction to rotate around and it did the exact same rotation. Okay. This platform right here, you can completely miss the timing on. Because it does not, they're not all synced up. And I think that is honestly the worst of the rooms. This room, um, it's, uh, dangerous, but not as bad. I think there's also a whistle down here. I'm not going to get it. room. Yeah, just health. And I do believe we are past the worst of the rooms. I think. Get on here, but I don't think there's anything up here. Yeah. Missed opportunity, I guess. There is a whisk whistle above it. This one I will get, because, I mean, why not? And there we go. So really, the, the first room is the worst one. Uh, the one after it, with the spike balls, is supposed to be difficult. It I don't find it that tough. I should hurry. But you can see, I still had all about two minutes even with all my failing. you go this time. <laughs> okay, and we are done there. That also does not give us anywhere new to go. We also have not gone to coolant yet. Which I'm fairly certain is actually the next place we go. Let's go to Porto. Talk to people. I heard the archaeologist doing research in coolant was once a palace guard. I also heard his grandson is now the captain of the palace guards. A long time ago, extremely cold weather froze a lake, creating coolant. I hate cold weather. My skin gets dry and rough, you know. Burzen was vandalized by the Black Cats gang, but now it's finally quieting down. By the way, your grandfather was here to examine the Iron Giant's head. Was here? The Iron Giant's head isn't here. Okay. He's one of the miners, I guess. Anyways. Uh, should get a transmission, because that's how progress goes in the late game. After that... I will save and end this part. I've got a message. Who's it from? Waffle, my boy. Grandpa, where are you? I'm at the first in mine. I want to ask you a favor. Can you come over here? He hung up. Grandpa only thinks about himself. Oh, I should ask him to take a look at these crystals, too. Okay, so next time we go to the furs and mines. And then coolant. Coolant's also fairly short.
We are actually getting pretty close to the end of this game. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for enduring my terrible playing today. It will not be over. I will be recording the next part right after this. So we expect more terrible playing in the next part. Uh, Alright, yeah. I um, hope you enjoyed. Like I said, we are getting close to the end of this. Uh, I'm not sure how many more parts there will be. Coolin is fairly short. I can't remember what exactly is after that. It's, I think it's another similar to the factory. Yeah, they're not particularly long. So, anyways, I should be able to do both of those next time. Alright, yeah. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you stick around for more. And thanks for watching. <laughs>